Hey everyone, today we are checking out Elementary OS 8, the latest version of this beautiful Ubuntu based Linux distro. Elementary OS 8 is based on Ubuntu 24.04.1 LTS, which means it's built on a stable and long term supported foundation. Just last month, Ubuntu 25.04 dropped, but since that's an interim release and not an LTS, Elementary isn't adopting it. In fact, Elementary only releases based on LTS versions. So the next big upgrade will likely be based on Ubuntu 26.04. Until then, we are riding with this version 8. This release ships with the Linux kernel 6.8.0, offering up-to-date hardware support and performance improvements. Now some of its key features include a secure session. One of the headline features is a new secure session which uses Wayland for improved privacy and security. It requires users consent before apps can access input or screen content. Great for protecting your data. The classic session using X11 is still available and you can choose between them on the login screen by clicking on the settings icon. A second feature is a new dock. Elementary OS 8 features a redesigned dock. Compared to version 7, it is much sleeker and optimized for multitasking and window management. You will also notice subtle animations and effects like when you click an app to get an overview. Thirdly is hardware support. Hardware support is pretty solid in this release. Drivers for Wi-Fi, especially Broadcom cards and Nvidia graphics are easy to install. There is pipe wire for improved audio quality and since it's based on Ubuntu LTS you get access to the full hardware enablement stack for excellent compatibility. Fourth is Flatpak integration. Elementary OS 8 embraces Flatpak. The app center now defaults to FlatApp as its source, replacing apt for most applications. Unless you are firmly anti-Flatpak, this setup should work great for everyday use. Five is system updates. Automatic updates are now baked in. The system will check for updates when you are connected to the internet and notify you promptly. There is already an 8.0.1 update that includes bug fixes, dark mode support and a newer kernel so don't forget to update right after install. In terms of look and feel, Elementary OS is still one of the most beautiful Linux distros out there. It's modern clean and feels instantly familiar, especially if you are coming from ArcOS. The wallpaper selection is a bit limited, but hey, it's Linux. Changing it takes less time than brewing a cup of coffee. Now for pre-installed apps, the pre-installed apps here are minimal, which is great if you like a clean start. However, the default browser isn't great, so you would probably want to grab Firefox or Chromium from the App Center. Luckily, it's just one click install. As for the install requirements, to install Elementary OS 8, here's what you need. A recent Intel Core i3 or comparable 64-bit dual-core processor, at least 4 gigs of RAM, a minimum of 32 GB of SSD storage. Internet access is also required to download drivers and any available updates. This OS is not optimized for virtual machines, but it should work fine if you enable EFI support. Finally, if you appreciate the elementary OS team, consider donating something on the download page. Every bit helps. And if you found this video helpful, drop a like and subscribe for more Linux content. Enjoy your new distro. Thanks for watching.